All right, part six for the Mortal Kombat 1 campaign. So right now we're going to continue with playing as Melina. And again, if this is the first video that you've seen so far on this game, I do have episodes one through five already on my channel, ready to go. So let's go ahead and continue. And again, not great at fighting games. I'll say this each and every <laughs> video just to, you know, just in case someone finds this video uh, at random. But anyways, let us go. No part of me, Ermac. Amazing, Melina. In another life, you could have been Umgadi. <laughs> I prefer this one, dearest Tanya. <sighs> we must leave. Quickly. <sighs> Melina, wait. forest souls mine was one of them your attack broke the spell that binds us now i am in control father you are umgadi but not Li Mei. i replaced her after your death your majesty she left the order rather than accept punishment punishment it was not her fault. A discussion for another time, Father. We must go. Greetings, Jared. 
Liu Kang, my friend. We meet again. It is good to have you back. We once again find ourselves in challenging circumstances. And once again, we will prevail. As always, Sindel, I am yours to command. How is it they're unaware that the Soul Stealers are shut down? We are deep within the mountain. From here they couldn't tell. Look at them conspiring. It is history we should not be repeating. We must take the crown. Without it, he can't raise more warriors. Our odds will improve if we can surround them. I'll distract them while the rest of you get into position. Leave it to me, Mother. Princess Molina. I bring news from Outworld. Sindel is deposed. General Shao now rules. And yet you are still free. To succeed, the General needed help on the inside. I provided it. The heir to the throne gives it up willingly. <laughs> it is a burden I've never wanted. The realm is better left in General... Uh, Emperor Shao's hands. A most mature perspective. Outworld benefits from your wisdom. Yes, Shang Tsung, it does. But not in the manner that you expect. <laughs> an impressive display of guile. Who knew she was so capable? You count yourselves among my doubters? I will count you among the dead. Fight. There will be consequences for forsaking Outworld. Thanks to the Princess, this fight is ended. The fight, perhaps. Not the battle. True. Until your benefactor is caught, the realms remain threatened. Who is she, sorcerer? <laughs> Speak of the devil. Liu Kang, meet Damashi. Damashi? You are the victim of deception, sorcerer. You're not Damashi. You're me. 
More correctly, you are me. A poor facsimile, anyway. Made lesser by Liu Kang's meddling. What's happening here? Who is he? This Chang Song is whom I battled for the hourglass. I thought him dead. As I did you, Liu Kang. It turns out our battle released mammoth energies which ripped apart time's fabric. The fight had two conclusions. In one, I was the victor. In the other, it was you. It was eons before I discovered this. Once I did, I knew the path forward. I took this form and infiltrated your timeline. I elevated these wretches, giving them great power. Together, they sowed discord among the realms and assembled for me the Dragon Army. I led them to believe they were aiding my conquest of Earthrealm and Outworld. But my intent is to exterminate all life in this timeline, and then merge it into my own. You promised us realms. Now you leave us to slaughter? You were pawns, not partners. Your purpose served. You will be sacrificed. We served you loyally. Built you the Dragon Crown. This? This is a toy. I do not need it to control the Dragon Army. Only the souls contained within. Neither you nor your timeline will be missed. It appears our interests align. For now. Know that I trust neither of you. I will finish you both at the first hint of treachery. <laughs> serves no purpose. This timeline will be destroyed. Fight! what Raiden could not.
Your tenacity is to be in mind. Until our last breaths are taken, as long as blood flows through our veins, we are not beaten. <laughs> Noble sentiments, which in the end matter little. None of you will leave here alive. lose her mother if my mother dies she won't be the only sin down to perish fight <laughs> You can't go. Not yet. It's my time, dear. At least we had a few hours more. I will cherish them. Mother. You are now Empress. Rule well. I will, Mother. Father and Katana will help me. Of course. Father, what did you do? I collected your mother's soul. It resides within me. She is safe. Hurry, everyone. We must withdraw. To move an army that large among realms, he'll need a portal, yes? More than one. You will need a nexus of portal gateways. It must be nearby. We follow them, they will lead us to it. Agreed. But we cannot strike until Raiden and Kung Lao arrive. That the Lin Kuei won't aid us is unforgivable. Li Han has corrupted them totally. When this crisis ends, we will deal with that one. This is but the opening battle in a longer war. 
Titan Shang Tsung has prepared his entire timeline for it. We cannot match its strength. My counterpart said that your battle with him ripped time's fabric, creating two timelines. But how do we know that it wasn't torn further? If there are two timelines, can't there be more? Why the thought experiment, sorcerer? You said we lack strength. We might find it in other timelines. How would we do that? We gather allies from across timelines. Other Titans to build an overwhelming force. If they exist, we have no proof that they do. We must fight the battle in front of us. We can't stake our survival on pure conjecture. If Liu Kang is right, the battle in front of us is already lost. This may be our only hope. Giris, your thoughts? It is possible. But as I am only the Hourglass's steward, such a search is beyond me. It can only be undertaken by the Keeper of Time. And I no longer wield that power. You may be able to regain it. What? How do you mean? When you gave up control of the Hourglass, I worried that one day you would find you needed it. So rather than let your power dissipate, I collected it. To this day, it remains safely stored. Why did you never tell me this? Because the process of restoring your power is likely irreversible. Returning to the life you have now as Earthrealm's protector, a life you cherish, may be impossible. And you did not want me tempted to make that sacrifice. Unless it was absolutely necessary. Correct. Thank you, Giris. You have saved us with your wisdom. Now, where have you stored my power? We must retrieve it. It is at the Fire Temple, stored in the Jade Jaguar gifted to you by the Great Kung Lao. Yes, Giris. Liu Kang has proven more resilient than anticipated. He and his comrades have escaped the fortress. Forget the others. Find Liu Kang. He alone threatens my plans. You could have picked no better vessel to store my power, Giris. I have always treasured the great Kung Lao's gift. It reminds me of his meticulous nature, and his generous heart. Once we retrieve the Jade Jaguar, we will proceed to the Hourglass. There, we will transfer the temporal power stored within it to you. It now occurs to me that all along, you have had unfettered access to the power stored within. You could have taken it, become Keeper of Time, but chose not to. Why? Because I have faith in your vision for this new era. I am content to be its guardian. Thank you, Gareth. Now, this process you propose, you are sure it will restore my power? As sure as I can be of one that has been neither tried nor tested. But even if successful, it is not guaranteed that you will find any other timelines or allies. They may not exist. <sighs> I pray this is not a fool's errand. I hate leaving the others behind. Your champions will bolster their strength against the dragon army. It is sure to be the mother of all battles. May the Elder Gods protect them.
My ex was so wrong. The 30k I spent on this seems like a steal right now. This magic is incredible. Not magic, your loveliness. Technology. Either way, it's clear what must happen next. The gateways and the dragon army have to be destroyed. Scorpion, have you a plan? We must divide our forces. You, Shang Tsung, Quan Chi, will use your magic to attack the portals. As you do, Kenshi and Jared will grind down the dragon army. The rest of us will attack our dark doubles. If they're defeated, it will hopefully throw the dragon warriors into disarray. An astute strategy. Truly, I could not have devised a better one. Enough with the empty flattery. If you want our trust, give us actions, not words. It is time. Our venom will spread. It will be the end of all things. Armageddon. Is unfortunate. The battle continues, Shang Tsung. Quan Chi, with me. I, for one, am not pleased we were double-crossed. It is an ire I share. May I suggest we harness our anger and use it to obliterate my doppelganger's minions. Fight! <laughs> This pair will trouble us no more. There are more who acquire our attention.
You're welcome, sorcerers. Is it me, or is that Raiden becoming insufferable? You are not wrong, but it is tomorrow's problem. Let us first solve today's. Fight! <laughs> Problem solved. Now on to the next. His life force is feeding the portal's energy. We kill him. We close them permanently. These meddling minions grow tiresome. Let us finish them. Fight! So much for fire and ice. Are you hurt? 
hurt. <laughs> I've never been better. Fools. Your spell worked before only because you surprised me. It won't happen again. Fight! <laughs> Soul is ours. Army's trapped. All of the other realms in this timeline are safe. Never forget, Raiden, that we risked our lives to perform this service. One that wouldn't have been needed if you hadn't conspired with the other Shang Tsung. They will fight to the last man. Come, we must help the others. Timelines and titans to find. Garrus? Liu Kang? Easy, Katana. You are among friends. What's happened? Where am I? A long way from home. In a different timeline, to be precise. What? Are you also a... A keeper of time? Yes. Both of us? How is that possible? The battle for Kronika's hourglass ripped apart time's fabric. Where there once was one timeline, there are now many. Each new timeline represents a different possible outcome of that battle. In mine, I became Time's Keeper. In yours, it was you. In others, it could be Jade, Sindel, even Kano. The possibilities are endless. If many timelines sprung from one, and we were both part of it, then... you are... you are my... Lukang. The same one who battled you in Shang Tsung's courtyard. Who fought at your side at the Colosseum. Who beamed with pride when you became Outworld's Khan. Why does fate seem always to conspire against us? Deny us life's simple pleasures. 
I don't know. Perhaps in one of the many timelines, they are ours. I would like to think you brought me here for them. But I know you well enough to know better. What duty beckons us? I will tell you. But first, we must gather more of our old friends. Shang Tsung, the Titan, wielding the power of the Hourglass? Yes, Kung Lao. He is a threat to all timelines. He is not yet aware of any beyond his and Liu Kang's. For now, it is only a matter of time. I had hoped my victory over Kronika would end the endless cycle of combat. Sadly, it begins anew. We have no choice. We must stop Shang Tsung. The millions in my White Lotus Society will aid us, if needed. Thank you, my friends. He is here. found allies. Titan allies, in fact. How could I have been so blind? Of course our timelines aren't the only two. Retreat to yours, Shang Tsung. Your attempt to merge timelines has failed. Yes. Your comrades proved most resourceful. Thus, I have resigned myself to simply destroying your timeline. Knowing that others exist to conquer makes that choice much more palatable. Once I destroy your hourglass, your timeline will cease to exist. I will take great pleasure in finishing you one last time. Remember, I know what you'll do before you do it. Likewise. Let's hope our advantage proves decisive. Fight. Fighting by Katana's side. Let's rip the flesh from their bones. For Tanya's of all timelines, this evil might as no better. You should meet mine. She's a vast improvement. I'd like that. Should we survive this battle? Fight! <laughs> Yeah! 
are you the best Shang Tsung can do? It has begun. Bested twins far more evil than you. Fight! Back to your timeline, brothers. We have little time. The hourglass is failing. Then let us end this now. Be good girls and kill them, won't you? As you command, Shang Tsung. Katana and I will fight them. You save the hourglass. Yes, you can. <laughs> Cannot save it. I don't know which of them is worse. Both are cracked reflections of me. They are abominations. Neither will survive this fight. Fight! Once Shang Tsung is finished, you will be too.
isn't over, Liu Kang. Thank you, everyone, for your aid. This battle was won together. Shang Tsung is gone, but he's not defeated. He will be back to renew his campaign. Not only against this timeline, but against all timelines. Our choice is clear. We must take the fight to him. Destroy any power he has to make war against us. Agreed. Shang Tsung is likely already gathering allies as I gathered you. We must best his efforts. Assemble an overwhelming army from across all timelines. to run, Shang Tsung. Nowhere to hide. We have banded together to rid all timelines of your evil. The threat you pose to them ends today. Such certainty, Liu Kang, that this battle will end in your favor. It can end no other way, because across all timelines, the arc of history bends toward justice. Does it? In this timeline, it bends toward me. Behold, Liu Kang, the hell I unleash upon you.
the Shirai Ryu. sense of self-preservation. Fight! Thank you, Kitana. You're welcome. Now hurry. There's no time to waste. <laughs> Prepare to be dismembered. Fight! Ah. 
Assist me, Quan Chi. Scorpion, you are almost there. the scorpion follow me your defenses have failed Shang Tsung this is over I do not think so realize sorcerer that you've brought this on yourself Avarice and Ego have again proved your undoing. We have no choice but to eradicate you. It is you who will be eradicated. You and your followers. And once you are dead, all timelines will be mine. Your position is precarious. To survive, you must submit. Yes. The question you must ask is, if Liu Kang couldn't finish us, how possibly could you? Fight! 
To survive, you must submit. Yes. The question you must ask is, if Liu Kang couldn't finish us, how possibly could you? Fight. <laughs> And they called me the Chosen One. I am honored, Liu Kang. Shall we finish this? You have done more than enough. Please permit me to end this. That be the last we see of you. What's happening? Fly my. Without Shang Tsung to hold it together, it's falling apart. You must return to your timeline before this one collapses. Thank you for your aid, Scorpion. May we one day meet again. I'm telling you, the locations we found here are money. I mean, look at this. Don't the rainbow colors on these mountains just scream outworld? I cannot believe you'll be telling our story about how we defeated Shang Tsung. Well, the studio thinks it's fiction, not fact. <laughs> but I don't care, as long as it's covering the budget. <laughs> I assume you'll be the star. Nope. I'm behind the camera, writing and directing. Time to let someone younger and prettier take the lead. You know, I've written in parts for all of you, if you want them. Us? On screen? I mean, they're cameos. But like they say, there are no small parts. Thank you, Johnny. But we must decline. But Raiden! The new initiates arrive tomorrow. We must return to the Wuxi to begin their instruction. Of course, you are right. What about you, Takahashi? I need a blind swordsman. And no actor can do what you do. <laughs> I would love to. But my work to revive the Tyra is starting to pay off. I can't let up now. Well, I know better than to ask you. Your plate is always full. Indeed, Johnny Cage. Which is why I must now depart. Off to Outworld? To advise the Empress? Between her father and her sister, Melina is receiving plenty of good advice. And with the sorcerers and the general imprisoned, there are few threats to her rule. Is something wrong, then? 
I am simply shoring up our defenses. As you know, Bi Han and his Lin Kuei have abandoned their roles as Earthrealm's guardians. His brother, Kuai Liang, has agreed to build a new clan, the Shirai Ryu, to take its place. I must go aid his efforts. Is there anything we can do? Not yet, but I will call upon all of you when the time comes. Madame Bo, once again you have served an excellent meal. That's kind of you to say. Enjoy the rest of your evening. And thank you, all of you. You have served well as Earthrealm's champions. No, Liu Kang. Thank you. Joining up with you really has changed the arcs of our lives. I am glad. All right, gentlemen. If you're finished, there's only one thing left to do. Which one of you gets the bad news? Whew, not me. I'm still three mil in the hole on Sento. How uh, thick's your wallet, Takahashi? Thick enough. But seems to me our hosts are on the hook. They did invite you us. You think we have money? The Shaolin live modestly. Don't worry, Father. I've got this covered. Besides, my business manager tells me I can write this whole thing off. The realms are in safe hands. I don't know if this sound or song is going to be like copywritten at some point so I'll go ahead and just uh, talk about or talk uh, about the game over it just in case and stuff like that but overall like I really enjoy the story um, I gotta say that it was a little bit odd having the the old Armageddon thing happen towards the end that probably should have been maybe a little bit later on uh, like for future titles in this new resetted timeline, but I'm not too sure. It was really cool to see all these different variations and stuff. Um, but I do got to say that when they were probably in development of this thing uh, a couple years back, I would say that it was uh, multiverse and other things like that were much more of the new hotness. So now that that has really fell, uh, fell through, especially for the... The two big comic book people um it was a it was a little bit odd to see but it was again it was pretty cool to see different <laughs> the different variants of uh of some of the fighters now i don't know if that changes if you were to choose someone else i chose scorpion because um scorpion is my has always been my main character uh him and raiden uh going all the way back for sure and stuff but um yeah uh it was it was nice, a um, little bit of a head scratcher as to, I guess, uh, technically everyone in Mortal Kombat 11, if you've beaten Chronicon um, and got the hourglass powers, I guess you survive. At least that was something that I was uh, kind of scratching my head. Thought it impossible. 
warriors from across timelines clashing in combat. <laughs> the blood, the death, the chaos. Yes, Lord Havoc. It's unfortunate it all ended so fast. The next time, it won't. Well, all right, again, I was not expecting that, but as soon as I saw something, I shut up immediately. So that was sort of interesting. Now, I don't know if that properly sets up for a continuation for Mortal Kombat 2. Um, I, uh, I don't know. I suppose at this point, we're just going to get different types of stories. I would say moving forward. Um, it started as a very simple tournament in the first game. Uh, Shao Kahn in the second game. Shao Kahn again in Mortal Kombat 3. And uh, Shinnok in, in the fourth, but um, I don't know. I have no idea how they're going to, uh, what they're going to do moving forward. And, um, you know, I'm always up for the surprises. It was great to see, um, again, I think I said this in part, probably part one of the uh, story where I saw um, uh, Baraka and then uh, Reptile. Uh, the, actually, that might have been like part two or part two or three. But anyways, um, in my series, it was great. You know, it, it's really crazy how everyone in uh, Liu Kang's new world um, listened to reason. So I thought that was uh, really interesting. Um, but uh, I guess the Tarkatans are, it's a disease rather than um, a sort of race in the outworld. And I don't know. Um, it was just great to see a, a different spin on some of these characters that, uh, that are extremely familiar. Um, but yeah really really damn good but uh at this point in time i think it's uh fully released i pre-ordered it qu uh, well, quite a while ago so i was able to play this just a couple of days early but it's great again mortal kombat is a very important part in my gaming history i would say so you know it's always great you know as long as i can hold a controller in my hand and as long as they keep making these then of course i plan on uh keep on playing them for sure so well i guess we're gonna go ahead and wait out to see if there's another end credit scene i i gotta be honest i was expecting potentially blaze to make an appearance especially in in the old uh in that post credit scene or mid credit scene sorry that's what i was you know expecting because again mortal kombat armageddon I, I was thinking about that back in 2007 ish six or seven i'm not too sure many moons ago um let's see i don't know i don't know what, what what else comes next and i just gotta be surprised so i think that might be enough of my rambling we'll see what happens after the credits but um yeah we'll come back we'll let it uh we'll let it keep going for a little bit
Well, you know what? Let me go ahead and come back. <laughs> Since this is a... Uh, it takes a an army to create games nowadays, and I'm really thankful for every person here. But um, going back to the story a little bit, like with Damashi, I was like, well, there we go. We're getting some Mortal Kombat deception with the story with Shujinko and stuff like that. Which I gotta say, hands down, the Mortal Kombat Conquest and Deception was the absolute perfect, and I really wish that that would make it come back. Um, you know, full open world and all of these different um, types of cameos and stuff like that. That would un wonderfully be its own game. And and Shaolin Monks, you know, bring this, bring some of that back too. That was also a really great game. Um, I don't know if Mortal Kombat will spin off again. They don't really tend to do as well as the mainline series, I would say, but um, I don't know. Who knows? Maybe test the waters, especially after so many, well, about a decade or, or so at this point in time. Uh, maybe a little bit more than that. Um, that would be pretty cool to see like a Shaolin Monk return or um, mythologies game. A single, uh, a single character RPG. I don't know. But um. Going back to with, with Damashi, I was like, are we going to see Onaga? Is it going to be like the Dragon King being rumored and stuff like that back or um, just a little bit more? Again, tons of Easter eggs for those who have played the, the entire series and stuff like that. And, you know, something exciting for people to go back and re-experience or to experience for the first time um, by playing some of the older games, which would be nice if they came out with like a like combat collection. You know, just playing all of the damn, uh, just bring all the old games and put them um, on a disc. You know, all the arcade games, uh, even the NES, or not any, whoa, not NES, uh, the game, the Game Boy games that are, you know, fairly rough, you know, it would be nice to have all those. Just everything from the past, just go ahead and just bring it, you know, to the current, you know, it would be nice to play Mortal Kombat Deadly Alliance, Mortal Kombat Deception. Hell, even Armageddon in 4K, you know, really clean up those older visuals and stuff like that and bring them. Uh, those, those are really great. I think Mortal Kombat Deception out of that PS2, Xbox era, probably my favorite fighting game, I would say, in terms of Mortal Kombat. Um, Armageddon was a little bit weird, but it was kind of cool to create your own character. I made a really interesting like scorpion hybrid that was a uh, pretty op especially with some of the combos i i was uh really proud of myself i think i had like a 20 maybe like a 25 hit combo or something i don't know but i was a much much younger man back in those days but i don't know it would be nice to have all of those older games brought back up to um to current for all the current platforms and platforms moving forward i would say um, sure, there are emulation uh, that you can download on the computer and everything pretty much has a screen nowadays, but I would pay to play those ROMs um, on a fully licensed product from uh, NetherRealm Studios, just dusting off those other things, but that's something that I would personally want. Again, I don't know about the uh, um, certain litigation that has to happen, and of course people have to get paid, but... Yeah, now I'm just going to be rambling until uh, we see if there is a post credit scene at the end of this and stuff. So I don't know. Who knows? Uh, if you made it to my second little rambling spot, you know, thank you so much. And wouldn't blame me if you fast forward for sure. <laughs> I don't want to press start and skip it, which I don't know. Who knows? That probably might have been it. Um, we're getting towards these other studios that really helped out with this. So we're going to go ahead and wait. But uh, as for future characters, I suppose, you know, again, going back to this whole multiverse thing. Anyone can come back. Um, with Scorpion being um, Sub-Zero's brother. And in the, I guess in the original lore, um, he becomes the second Sub-Zero that becomes the Grandmaster. Uh, for him to be sub or Scorpion is, you know, I mean, it was cool. It was a nice little spin. I don't know if we're going to get uh, Hanzo back 
or if uh, they're going to be an old switcheroo where um, the scorpion that we knew will become the sub zero, whereas the sub zero that we um, know was what well, is now the scorpion in this new timeline and stuff. I don't know. No idea. But uh, we are sure as hell getting towards the bottom, though, I would say. But uh, as for characters making a comeback, you know, it's really great to see that they are they pulled um, some pretty... Uh, <laughs> they pulled in deep in, in, with some of these characters. When I saw Darius, I was like, wow, okay. You know, I was expecting Cobra or Kira. I don't know. There's always, of course, there's always possibilities of, of them coming back. So how that very, that some people really do not like. Um, it was interesting to see that they didn't have a Kano in, at least in the main. Um, oh, here we go. Some more. We're, we're at the end of the credits. Uh, a Kano as part of the, the main story. Even though, I mean, sure, we saw some Kanos and stuff like that. But I don't know. It's really great to see that. Uh probably be saving him for the next one who knows maybe Kano might be a good guy and who uh um we might see uh Sonya as a bad guy that could be interesting as a pirate of some sort and Kano part of the special forces ah that would be weird but oh well we will see That's the end of the credits, guys. Nice, got an achievement. Thank you for being a fan, it says. Invasions, okay. Oh, well, got another achievement. What just happened? That's fair. That is really fair. It is just, it is interesting again, uh, you know, tapping into the multiverse where at this point in time, um, I think main, main audiences are really over that sort of stuff. And we sort of need to dial that back and to focus into a, a one single continuity as opposed to going into the what if. Um, but uh, again, at the time of writing, I don't believe that Mortal Kombat was... Uh, you know, probably figure that uh, most audience... Well, actually, they did it pretty well because most audience are aware of how multiverse logic to a, a point makes some sort of sense. But... This was cool. This was really cool. Uh, so, before I end this, um, I do not have any of these people yet. Speaking of uh, Dimashi and all that, Chujinku and Mutaro. I don't know how to... Select any of these, or to unlock these other characters. So, I don't know if I have to play Invasions to unlock them, but, you know, it is what it is. I'll, I'll give this game a fair shot. Um, a fair shot for sure. Okay, I unlocked Havoc. Nice. And, of course, there's going to be more DLC as well. Was a little unfortunate that she died again, but who knows? Again, uh, Ermac slash Jared has her soul, so we might see her possibly be reborn. Let's see if we got with, with our boy. We got a new pallet. Ooh, that's cool. Make that mask better. At some point, I gotta work on the fatalities. I sure as I've got a lot for Sub Zero, though.
looks pretty cool. That looks pretty cool. <laughs> Off blue. That is pretty funny. I I think I'm gonna keep my sub zero as this. <laughs> I didn't know that was a thing. I know that I, I pre ordered and probably got some uh some different things, but I would say that it, it's a lot simpler nowadays. I remember like in the other Mortal Kombat games, you got just tons and stuff, tons of stuff from it. And it's just like, wow. Let's see. Jackie Cage was pretty funny. Let's see. Um, I'm not going to uh, waste your time in showing you like everything and stuff like that. I'm just going to see if I have different palettes for uh, the different characters and stuff like or different uh, other skins. That's cool. Would be good to get like a classic rain skin. Was expecting like old man Raiden or something like that. Gang, do we have a different? Oh, all right, what's him? Yeah, I think, uh, I don't know what exactly I got from the pre-order. So that's why I'm just uh I'm just going like back and forth just to see. Experiments of her. Um Yeah. Um, so that's going to be it. Um, as for the rest or other things, other types of... Um, I don't know what's next. I might record the fatalities for each character. I know that I did that during the beta. Not individually, but... I might do that individually for each of these characters. I don't know how many finishers they're, they're going to be. So we'll see. Again, I don't edit my videos, so I'll probably just pause it. If I do uh, successfully press <laughs> the, um, well, I guess there's there's a fatality um, training. I think I saw that there. Who knows? Maybe I'll just do that and just have a, a ton of like, you know, one minute long videos or something like that. And then there's also the cameo fatalities too. So there's also that. But um, anyways, that's going to be it. A lot of rambling. Um, final part for this wonderful game. It's always great to see Mortal Kombat. But um, well, we'll see what's next in terms of a, of a series. But I guess I would stay tuned to see 
tons of more fig, um, well, fatalities, tons of more Mortal Kombat content. And then um, we'll see what's next. But again, thank you so much. And I'll see you on the next one. Take care.